Hi guys, this is a video about setting up um, uh, an electric adjustable uh, table. I know most of us are working from home nowadays, so it's always good to have these tables where you can adjust them and be able to work on your laptop while you're standing. Uh, I had one of these at my office now that I'm working remote. It's definitely gonna We're gonna start with the bay, with the desktop. Uh, I got the wooden rods that are going to go on the sides and uh, are going to bring together the two uh two? the two Mine. desk tops all right so i'm gonna insert these into these holes and then we'll put this together now first thing all right got everything unboxed you've got the desktop uh boards right here you got the support beams you got the legs left leg right leg uh, um, and then we've got uh, the rest of the pieces, the side brackets. Uh, so everything and the screws uh, over there. So um, just a matter of getting ready to put this together, starting with the baseboard and then moving down, uh, down the list. Next is connecting the, the left leg and the right leg with the support beam and i have this wrench this allen uh, screwdriver uh, and these special nuts uh, that i'm going to screw on those ends to keep this intact the support beam is going to separate these two legs and attach them together so here we go all right wooden rods are in as you can see now it's just a matter of bringing this together, aligning it, and inserting it, and that should be the, the first step. All right, board looks good together. Uh, and now we're moving on to uh, the legs. All right, so we got one side of the, the, the legs connected to the support beam. We have to put the, the other support beam on the other side. But right now, we're moving on to step two which is connecting a support beam on the other side. Next step is to put the base on the legs. As you can see, these are the legs being held up together by support beams on both sides. Now next is the base that's gonna go on top. Yeah, like that. Once that's on, I'm gonna do the other side as well and then we'll be all set. All right, leveling studs are in, the base is secure. Our support beams are in place and the uh, legs are attached. So now I'm gonna flip it over and uh, start working on the top. All right, we got the support beam on both sides uh, of the legs. So we're rolling in. All right, so we got the bases on here. Uh, so we, oops, stay away. We got the bases, we got the legs, we got the support beams, and now we're gonna put the leveling studs. All right, side brackets are done. Now it's just a matter of uh, putting the desktop on top and then um, we should be right on our way. All right, next stage is just to screw the entire piece onto the desktop. So we got it all aligned and now it's just a matter of uh, putting those screws in. All set. All right, now that we've got our table in place, now we have to get the sync rod. This is the sync rod, comes equipped. Sync rod is gonna go in through there and there and we should be uh, right on all right sinking rod is in place installed and the ac adapter is also installed that's where part of this is going to plug into and now i have my control that i'm going to install right here and uh, we should be right on our way to get this flipped over and working all right next step got it flipped over Next step is to put the side brackets where the, uh, this is a side bracket. This is going to go right here. And uh, I have two of those, so one's going to be on the other side. Uh, and once that's done, they'll be able to put that board, uh, the desktop on top. Everything looks good on the bottom. The adapter is in place. Controller is in place. Now it's, to turn, now it's time to turn it over and test it out. All right, guys, I got chance to test it out uh, and it seems to be working just press the button there and it adjusts and the numbers show you where it's going it keeps going down as you can see we're down here 
not a lot of cables under the, the table, which is good. So as far as assembly, I think it would take about a good 45 minutes to take to put it together. Um, not a lot of tools required uh, other than the Allen key and the, the screws that come with it, but very self-explanatory, very basic. I'll put the link on where uh, I purchased it from. Uh, I'd certainly say it's a good, easy product to use. As you can see, my son is adjusting it. It's very simple, very basic. Okay. Uh, nothing to it. Uh, as far as how to use it. And now it's going up. Mm -hmm. 